Welcome to the SALT Sideline Report. I am Leanna Hawkins, and we are here at SALT New York, joined by Sarah Kuntz, Managing Director at Clio Capital. Welcome. Thank you. Sarah is a major boss in the boardroom. She's a diva on the dance floor. You should have seen her at Chainsmokers last night. I mean, the Chainsmokers, it was a good show. Like, they are great tech investors. I co-invest with them in things, but they're also really, really, really fun. And it's been a pandemic, so when you get the chance to dance your face off to live music with a few thousand of your closest friends in alternative investing, then of course you do it. <laughs> I loved it. And I loved watching you last night. We're so happy to have you back here. I know you have been with Clio and yourself personally partnered with Skybridge and Anthony for a long time doing many different things. Tell us about your initiatives with Skybridge right now and how the, the digital asset space has grown so much, even just in the salt world since 2019, our last our last conference. Yes, yes. So, I mean, the digital asset world is always growing. Um, I've been in crypto, you know, for since very, very early in my career. And so it's exciting to see huge conferences like this that focus so deeply now on digital assets, because a few years ago when you talked about that, everyone was like, do you mean my PayPal account? Or like, what are you talking about? We love PayPal and even PayPal is now into, you know, crypto. So so we're, we're, we're all roads lead to crypto and all crypto roads right now, it feels like lead to salt, um, you know, I think that that Anthony and Skybridge have done just an amazing job of understanding that there is a huge, huge opportunity in the market um, to help bring more traditional asset managers and more traditional assets into the digital asset world. Um, and so it's been really exciting to, to have them as investors in my fund and, you know, to to be able to partner with them on things like Salt Talks and panels and and just events like this where I get to, you know, see so many awesome companies, including some of my own, like like Falcon X, which is a, a prime brokerage for, for crypto, you know, in one place place meeting so many relevant awesome people in such an action-packed kind of few days and sarah you obviously are a huge person in crypto in and of yourself forbes 30 under 30 and many other accolades we could dive into but a lot of people watching this probably already know you or have seen you on a lot of skybridge's content already what are you focusing on at clio capital right now what do you what are the things you're most excited about you know, I'm, I think this is such an exciting time for tech. Um, I think that we are in just this moment of like, everything is happening. Um, so we are focused, you know, some of my favorite investments from the last few months include everything from Falcon X to, you know, Cameo, the, the celebrity shout out app that of course Anthony is on. So go buy that for all of your loved ones. I don't get a commission on that, but I should. Um, but you know, the, the reality is we invest in a great range of things um, because we think that there are so many areas right now in the tech ecosystem that are just, you know, just exploding and continuing to grow. Software is eating the world and we are still on the appetizer course. Well, Sarah, for the other young people that might see this on YouTube or another social channel, they're interested in digital assets. They're not in the institutional world, but they want to get involved. What would be your biggest point of advice to young people that are interested in digital assets? Don't be scared. Um, it feels so scary. It feels like you're too late. You're too far along. You don't know enough. What's DeFi? What's loot? What? It doesn't matter. Just go dip your toes in, right? Like I, I was talking to, I had a Bitcoin investor hat on the other day and I got stopped uh, by by somebody at the, the, the mechanic store of all places. And this woman was like, you know, I started investing in Bitcoin because with COVID, the bingo hall was shut. And so I put my bingo, my gambling money into crypto. Great. That's a great place to start with digital assets, right? Take your little like, hey, I'm not going to Vegas this year. So that thousand dollars, I'm not going to my, you know, we don't host our monthly poker and and just start experimenting. You can only lose money once, uh, but you can make a lot of money. And it's also just fun and interesting. And, and you know, I think I believe and most people here believe that it's the future. So who doesn't like knowing about the future early? Yeah. And what, what are your favorite platforms for investors at home to dip their toe in into digital assets? You know, I mean, if you're a bigger investor, obviously Skybridge has some amazing offerings. If you're an individual investor, um, you know, things like Gemini, uh, love those guys. I think they've done an amazing job, um, you know, and and things like even Robinhood where you can you can buy and sell for free. Um, and so it's it really, you know, the cost of entry is is almost zero, right? You don't have to buy an entire Bitcoin or entire ETH, right? Mm -hmm. You can you can put five dollars in and start playing around with it. And you know, a few years ago, I had like a dollar left in a random crypto wallet. I went back a couple of years later, it was a hundred dollars. 
right? So just imagine if I left $100 in or $1,000 or $100,000, and then this would be my living room. Yep, there you go. You got a 100 bagger right there. There you go. (laughs) Yes, yes. Thank you for your insight, Sarah. So happy to have you back at Salt in real life. And I'll see you on a a dance floor near you soon again. Hopefully. Thank you. (laughs) Thank you.